Floroma Town has now been completed and Team Galactic have been put off for a little bit longer. If you guys haven't seen the last episode, make sure you check it out in the top right corner of the screen right now. If you're all caught up, welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Brilliant Diamond playthrough here on the channel. And today, we're going to be continuing through this route, heading north to see what our next challenge is. The team looks like so. Jirachi has come in and has been an absolute boss since we got him. Lucio, Bi Barrel, Staravia, Budju, and Primplup make up the rest of the team. First things first today, we're taking on a trainer battle. It's a long way between Floroma Town and Eterna City, so let's battle. Looks like we got a bit of a trek on our hands today. Camper Zachary. What have you got, Camper Zachary? A Geodude. Okay. We fought a fair few Geodudes in our time let's see what confusion does half health already and another confusion finishes him off and from that battle by barrel grow up to level 16 we defeated camper zachary and please excuse what i'm wearing in this episode i'm about to go to the gym straight after this i wouldn't sit here in an adidas top otherwise now there are several different levels to this area and i feel like we're gonna have to be quite thorough if we're gonna get everything in it right i'm pretty sure if we go that way i'm heading dead north so i'm gonna go back down this way and see what we can find we've managed to get ourselves into another battle this battle is with aroma lady elizabeth bring it on girl i actually saw a tiktok the other day where a streamer was reading someone's name in chat and also trying to comment on this battle in particular i believe and he ended up calling this woman a milf Quite funny. Budju is no match for Jirachi. Nearly dead already. And another one finishes him off. See you later. And that's Lady Elizabeth defeated. Always good to beat a MILF. We found a Pokeball. And yet another trainer battle. This time Picnica Sienna. Sending out a Shinx. I do miss Shinx. I know we've got the evolution now. But Shinx was just a little bit cuter. We're still doing massive hits with Jirachi. Regardless of what opponent we come up against. One confusion still hits half their health. And there we go. Shinx has fainted. Budju is now level 17. And Sienna is about to send out Pachirichu. Which I think is an electric type Pokemon. So you know what? I'm just going to keep Jirachi out. Because it just steams th rolls through absolutely anything. I mean his quick attack literally did 1 HP. And a couple of confusions later. And they fainted. We are going to get to the point though where we don't have enough moves left for Jirachi. So we're going to have to think about using someone else. Jirachi grew up to level 13. And we defeated Picnica Sienna. Okay we can collect a couple of berries here. An Aurum Berry. And a Pisha Berry. I spammed A on this little platform here. Knew I'd find something. It was an antidote. Right, I think that's lit that little area down there done now. So I'm going to head north. And yet another trainer battle. Hiker Nicholas is his name. And Onyx is the Pokemon he's sending out. Once again, we've got Jirachi out here. It's a level 14 Onyx, you know. Which, if we were just using our best Pokemon, would be very easy to beat. But we're using a Pokemon with a little less levels. Admittedly, an overpowered mythic Pokemon. But, you know, it's making the game slightly harder. By that, I mean it takes two confusions to kill him and not one. And there we go, he's fainted. And we defeated Hiker Nicholas. This is, this is repetitive. <laughs> Maybe there's some new Pokemon in this area. Let's just play around in the grass a little bit. No, we've been, a, we've had a weasel before. I'm going to keep playing in this grass a little bit longer to see if we can find anything new. I'll only let you know if we go up a level at anybody. Primplup grew up to level 19 and wants to learn Bubble Beam. I love Bubble Beam. I think we'll forget Pound. I, I like the fact we've got Flying Move, Steel Move. I'm going to forget the normal move. Someone will tell me that was the wrong thing to do. You know what? We're only coming up against Weasels. I'm moving on after this battle. Jirachi grew up to level 14 and learned Helping Hand. We found a Repel and and another trainer battle. Battle girl Kelsey is here. Come on then, what you got? A match hop. Ooh, we've got Bi Barrel out. Bi Barrel's first attack did a little bit of damage, and I think we'll just have to chip away at this match hop. Ooh, Bi Barrel's been hit for one. Jesus Christ, Bi Barrel's just been destroyed. Prinplup is coming out next, and Peck is super effective. Bye bye, match hop. Staravia grew up to level 18 from that battle. Wants to learn the move Endeavor. I don't know what Endeavor does. Endeavor, this attack move cuts down the target's HP to equal the user's HP. Uh, I mean, it's better than double team, so we'll take it. I guess Staravia could be quicker than most Pokemon. And if they're on a lot of health, then we can just cut them down. I don't know. I don't know. That's the tactical side of, of Pokemon that I'm never going to learn. It's just it's just battle after battle at this point. Karina. What have you got, Karina? A Pipla. Oh, that's cute. This almost feels really nasty. Lucio, Thundershock. 
It didn't actually kill it. I thought it would have done one. I mean, the first one didn't do it. The second one did. And Lucio grew to level 18. Wants to learn the move Spark, which we'll take. We're going to forget Charge and learn Spark. And we defeated Karina. What's in this house here then? You think you can get through a turn of forest by yourself? Uh, maybe? You seem to be tired. Rest a while. Yes. Yes, that's going to um, heal our Pokemon. Result. I'm guessing that's because this is a very long route. Route 205 is a beast. We found a super potion. Knowing that we're about to go into a forest, Staravia is going to be our leading Pokemon because, you know, wing attack is just going to rinse this whole forest. Here we are, Eterna Forest. And who's this? Hello, my name's Cheryl. And you are? Okay, so your name is Ayres. I'm sincerely glad to meet you. Ayres, may I ask a big favour? I want to get through this forest, but I'm afraid of doing it alone. I've heard that there is a sinister group of people called Team Galactic about. Yeah, we've dealt with them. I think there'll be safety in numbers. Please, may I go through with you? We'll go with Cheryl. Sure thing. I'll keep your Pokemon in perfect health. What are you going to do? Heal us on the go? Oh, she's just following us around, look. Hey. Oh, my, it still hasn't fixed the thing where you glitch through them. That is horrible, man. I'm tempted to see what sort of Pokemon are in this area, actually. We might be able to catch something new. The rock is covered in moss. It feels pleasantly cool. I mean, we're running in the grass constantly and not finding anything. Ooh, trainer time. Double battle. Okay, then. Is it both of us? It is both of us. And they're sending out Pachirisu. And Wormpool, Staravia, and Chansey. Okay. Right, Wormpool is going down with a wing attack. One hit. Ooh, Pachirisu, you spark on me. Staravia's nearly dead. And paralyzed. Okay, they've sent out a Butilify. I'm sure that wing attack will probably be good against it. Chance is also paralyzed. Wing attack does kill the Butilify in one go. Know your Pokemon types, people. Bye Barrel grew to level 17 and Budju up to level 18. Surely Budju's going to evolve soon. That thing has just been a little pee thing for ages. Okay, out comes Silcoon and a wing attack kills Silcoon. Staravia is now stupidly low and Staravia's dead. We'll send Budju out, why not? Uh, the reason you don't, Matt, is because it only knows Absorb and is pretty useless. So instead, we'll call on Bye Barrel. Bye Barrel is much more effective, but I keep forgetting he's water type and I've bought him out against an electric. No, your Pokemon types, Matt. Nonetheless, it doesn't matter. We finished them off anyway. That was a lengthy battle, though. Rihanna and Jack have been defeated. Jeez, that was a painful battle, man. Hold on. Everyone's full health. Staravia died in that battle, no? I'm confused. Right, let's see if we can capture something in this grass. Oh, wow. Two wild Pokemon at the same time. Jirachi's grew up to level 15 from defeating the Wormpool in one go. We don't actually have a Wormpool yet, so we're going to try and capture one just to have it in the Pokedex. And... There we go. Got him. Now, there's part of me that wants to add him to the team, but I might just stay with Budgie just a little bit longer to see if he actually grows into anything. So, Wormpool was added to the box. We continue. We're just going to keep running, see if there's anything that isn't a Wormpool in this forest. Okay, a Silcoon. Staravia grew to level 19 from taking out the Wormpool. And we'll try capture the Silcoon, because, you know, we don't have it. And we got him. Happy days. Another Pokemon added to the Pokedex. I'm not sure if Silcoon is actually Wormpool's evolution. Someone let me know in the comments. Because if he is, I'm not going to bother trying to evolve Wormpool. And before we go into this next double battle, that's all we're going to do today. If you guys have enjoyed this video, please hit it with a massive thumbs up. Comment down below letting me know if Silcoon and Wormpool are any way related. And uh, subscribe to the channel if you're new. It would be very much appreciated. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Can't believe we met a Milfin Pokemon.